Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to another player review and this is my first ever FIFA 16 legend one We've got Deco. I used him in a squad yesterday and you guys were saying how about a review? So I thought I'd put it together for you guys And if you want to see other ones Let me know in the comment section and drop a like if you enjoy them And if you're needing ultimate team coins to afford players like Deco Then you can head over to FIFA ultimate team coins .com, use the code Fuji cheap safe fast and reliable Or if you're needing game codes for FIFA points then head over to G2A links will be found in the description but Deco is waiting for us let's do it this is the team that I was playing Deco in just in that cam position and if you watched my video yesterday on the instructions it was just working really really well I would actually suggest to play him cam center forward I don't think it would work as well and center mid you aren't really getting the full effect of Deco but 87 rated the card stats 83 pace 78 shot 89 passing and 88 dribbling those two stats passing and dribbling are amazing 39 defense and 68 physical so I played 10 games scoring seven goals and getting two assists now you wouldn't have thought what 78 shot on his card with seven goals that's that's pretty good going but his finishing is actually very good inside the box so keep that in mind but the stats on his card he has amazing ball control he's got really nice short passing a fantastic link up player as you would expect and the strength on on this card like i had to check it after the 10 games 65 strength now for a guy who's five foot nine that is pretty damn strong and he does feel um, quite hard to push off the ball in game so I like that he has got the four star skills which makes him uh, fun to use and he's going for around 600,000 coins on obviously on the Xbox there there aren't any legends on the uh, PlayStation so yeah if you want to pause the video and check his stats but let's get into the clips Deco for me was an absolute pleasure to play with and that is what you would expect from a 600,000 coin player now one thing I am going to say is get out all of the negatives so first thing obviously it's his height he's not the tallest but that's something you can't change he's a small guy he was born that way and secondly and these are the only negatives is his shot power that causes his long shots to not be as effective which is kind of annoying because it suggested in his in-game stats that he has good long shots but for me I couldn't really get them pop him but what I knew he was good at was dribbling dribbling past players dropping the shoulder quick acceleration he's really really quick and with that strength like I was on about in the in-game stats screen he does actually feel really strong on the ball so it's hard to knock off then he's through on goal and either finesse it with his left or right and you're going to have some fun positioning wise as well he keeps to his position he offers he always wants the ball he is a cam that is going to dictate the play and you really do feel his presence uh, on the pitch what a card without a doubt i'm going to have to give him uh, at least a 9.5 out of 10. The reason why he hasn't got a 10, obviously, is because of that low shot power, but it doesn't affect him uh, once he's actually in the box. And the clips that you're seeing, guys, hopefully it shows you how good he actually is. Passing-wise, it's second to none. Oh, man, Deco, what a card. I'm going to be trying more Legends, because if they're like this, then whew, I'm in for a treat. But, guys, uh, value for coins, I'm going to have to give him an 8 out of 10. Yes, he is good, but 600,000 coins is a lot for any player. So, yeah, if you've enjoyed my review, drop a like. Let me know in the comment section any other Legends that you'd like me to take a look at. And I will see you on the next video. Team out. Peace.